Hello, this video will show you how to create a shipment using the short form. To access the short form, go to Shipments and then select Create Domestic Short Form. Now, the purpose of the short form is to allow you to create a shipment and quote your customer by entering a very minimal bit of information. When you first come to the page, simply select the customer you would like to generate the quote for. And after you select the customer, you can then enter the order details. First, enter the origin zip code and then the destination zip code. Select your accessorials and then move on to your items to ship. We are going to do one pallet with 25 pieces, 250 pounds. I'm just going to type in test for the description. Usually you would put your product description here. Now, if you do know that your class, you can select the class from the class calculator. But if you're unsure of the class, simply enter the weight with the length, the width, and height, and our class calculator will do the rest. As soon as you enter the dimensions and the weight, it will give you an estimated class. You can always override the estimated class by selecting the class from the drop-down menu. If you would like to add another commodity item, just click on Add Item and add, add your next commodity line. Once you've added all your commodity lines, go ahead and click on Generate Quotes. Once you click on Generate Quotes, you will pull the rates from the system. These rates could be rates that have been provided to you or tariffs that you've already built into the system. Here's the pricing information. We will give you the carrier name, the transit time. If you click on this icon here, we'll show you the terminal information. We'll give you the rate, the fuel surcharge, the accessorials, and then the total. Once you decide on the carrier, simply click on Select Carrier, and then scroll down a little bit further to Cost Calculations. Cost Calculations will list out the line haul carrier, the buy rate, and the sell rate. It will show you the margin that you will receive on this order. We have another training video that will show you how to set up margins. Scroll down a little bit further, you'll see other charges, including your fuel surcharge, the total accessorials, and so on. Once you are ready, click on Save and View Details, and that will save the order. Once you save the order, you'll be brought to the Shipment Details screen, where you can go ahead and send the quote to your customer. To access the quote sheet, simply click on Shipment Documents, and then click on Quote Sheet. This will bring up the quote sheet. And then you can click on send and you can send this a number of different ways. You can go ahead and enter an email address at the top here and then select the quote sheet and click send email. You can also send a message in the body of the email by typing that message here. You can also fax, print and download the document. Going back to the shipment detail screen from here, you can go ahead and update the statuses and use the other shipment tools. For more detailed information about the Shipment Details page, please visit our other training videos. Thank you.